Let's move on to the big race of the day. It's the uh, King George of Campton Jewel off at 3.05. Nicola, it's your highlight of the yep. Christmas. So uh, go on. What do you make of it? Uh, well, my fight, obviously, title defender and favourite at 5-2, to two, looking for back-to-back -back wins. Um, 11 horses have stood their ground. Um, so it looks interesting. I think waiting patiently at 9-2 has to be my pick. He's done nothing but impress me so far, unbeaten over fences, and I think he can improve again. Um, I just think with my fight, he ran below par at Haydock, and there just there's some doubts there that it's just not enough that I would want to back him. But if anyone can course and back to you know top form, it is going to be Nicky Henderson. Um, Nichols, he's looking for his tenth winner in the race. He's got Politologue in there at nine to two, who's been backed already during the week. Nine Bristol to Demai, <sighs> six to one. Thistle Cracks, thirteen to two. And Native River. Uh, Gold Cup winner has to be respected as well at seven to one and sets the standard on form. I mean, this is a brilliant race, isn't it? And yeah, like John, uh, a nine to two Politologue does seem to be the wrong price in that list. But aside from anything else, what yeah, you it's it? it's like it's 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 when you're reading at the prices there, like you're kind of going, yeah, yeah, and then you go, whoa, when was the last time I looked at the market? When did Politologue become <laughs> yeah. nine to two? Like it's like he ha certainly has his chance, and I, I'm just not convinced that he will stay. Like I just watched, I know he's a different horse now, and he's had the wind up, but. When you look at the, the Queen Mother last year, he, he barely got up the hill. like And, and I just don't know. Like, it's, He's it's, just shortened up throughout the week. Yeah, it's the one they're yeah. and like, I wouldn't, uh, I'm not saying that I wouldn't be surprised if he won. I'm just surprised that... 9 to 2 is become, an absolutely yeah. horrendous yeah. Yeah. Like price. All these horses are having their second start. They're going to be primed. There is, like, it's, it's, it's shameful. And I'm embarrassed and I'm ashamed of myself. But there's only one horse that's overpriced. And that's Bristol Demai. Yeah, I, I I think like I I'm embarrassed even saying it, and, and it's probably what about like, last year's run it, it's race something so. like you're gonna go after the race, and mm. you're gonna go what an idiot I was. But when you go through that list, and you kind of we say call it yourself, the new one fallacy. That's what you should do. Yeah, <laughs> I, I don't even know if it is that. I think we're like I couldn't back him after he run the race last no, year. No, I know that, like, I know that. But he did have he was so fragile last mm. season. Nigel Twist and David said it was a it was a constant constant grind to try and get him fit each time. And like I just go back, I've watched the Betfair Chase now, I've watched it 10 times and he was the only horse ever going to win that race. And he was the only horse that was in his comfort zone the whole way. I think if he jumps the first two or three fences, fine. The wind up has obviously made a huge difference. Mm. Second run after wind up, he, 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 won it, uh, he won the Betfair Chase. He ran well behind my fight at Aintree. Look, he probably mightn't win, but he's the only horse in the race that's overpriced at the moment. What price did... Might fight go off last year. Seven she was to four or so. Yeah. yeah. Mm. How is he not overpriced? He improved. Yeah, he improved some of his first run. This is every a better year. race now, in fairness. It is and a he wasn't race. impressed from the race no, last year. And he comes in on the back like, of. Yeah. Like, there's, when you, you don't have an explanation for he's run the last year. So it's like, well, why did he run that badly? Shape well for three quarters of the race, but bombed out. Yeah. And Native River, is there a more reliable horse in training? Like, what okay. do you fancy? I, at the price, I go Native River because I think he'll run well. I've a, I've a worry about Mike Bike because he wasn't impressed from the race last mm. year. That form isn't worth tuppence. The the horse he beat last year wouldn't be T for yeah. three, and they wouldn't be mapped in this. And obviously, we um, got one more to the party. Yeah, <laughs> T for I, two. A T for two, rather. I was on to. <laughs> God, I was on to Eddie O'Leary today. I was just like, God, is Shattered Love any chance she'd run this? Because like. Like it'd be just great to see her. I really yeah. think she's a chance. For I, the think she's a, I think she. I think she is an absolutely outstanding yeah. place chance. In the Why, the what Jiggy boys are so patriotic. Like you know, Michael he pays his taxes in Ireland, and his horses are all trained in Ireland, and they don't run in England very often unless it's yeah. at Cheltenham. So he, apparently, she's not going to run here, and I think she, she either will take on more respect, or she just won't run at all this Christmas. So I don't know why they they wouldn't because um, they could she would have a right good chance in this race I think yeah. but um, I think Nathan River is solidly trained because he, he's one of the most likable horses in training he'll be out there he'll jump well I think Bristol Demai might mm -hmm. fall into a hole again and I've a little doubt about might bite even though you could see him winning the race Palisa Log at nine to two he's enough to prove without stamina to even be that price yeah right go on along the line who do we go with Nicholas start with you Wait King George patiently. winner Wait impatiently Johnny King George Native winner River King George winner. Oh. Bristol the my but like no confidence really. Okay then. I'm actually with waiting patiently as well, despite making a case. Will he run? I, I don't know if he'll run. Oh, when does when does he run? When no, does I he just, run? I know. He's been waiting patiently. The, for, the yeah, forecast exactly. is so good for for Kent, and I just worry whether. He'll run.